आइसोलेशन ऑफ डी एन ए फ्रॉम बनाना दिस इज अ क्लास ट्वेल्थ बायोलॉजी प्रैक्टिकल द मटीरियल रिक्वायर्ड फॉर दिस एक्सपेरिमेंट आर बनाना लिक्विड डिश वॉशिंग सोप टेबल सॉल्ट सीव कोल्ड एल्कोहल जिप बैग एंड द स्टिरल टेक अ हाफ फील राइट बनाना इन टू अ जिप बैग एड स्मॉल अमाउंट ऑफ वॉटर इन टू इट जस्ट प्रेस द बनाना इन द जिप बैग फॉर अबाउट अ मिनट अंटिल ऑल द लम्प्स आर गॉन सो जस्ट प्रेस इट जेंटली सो दैट ऑल द लम्प्स आर गॉन सो वेन बनाना इज कंप्लीटली मैस्ड देन अ स्मॉल अमाउंट ऑफ सॉल्ट इज एडेड इन टू इट सो नाउ वी विल एड अ सॉल्ट इन टू दिस बैग आफ्टर एडिंग द सॉल्ट जस्ट क्लोज द बैग एंड वेरी जेंटली स्क्वीज एंड मूव द सॉल्ट द वॉटर विच इज ऑलरेडी एडेड एंड द बनाना मस्ट टूगेदर and repeat this process to 30 to 45 second that just squeeze the bag gently so that all the mixture completely mix now the next step is to add the dish washing soap into the zip bag so we will add a very small amount of this dish washing liquid into this bag and now one of the important viva question what is the role of this liquid when liquid soap is added then cell membrane and nuclei are broken apart and the dna is able to release here then gently mix the content but just try to avoid making too much of foam so just try to mix it gently here now next step is just to filter this liquid so we will use this sieve to filter this mixture and collect all this in a beaker here now just to create a short content i have increased the speed of the video in actual process this is occurring at a very slow rate but just i have increased the speed of this video here so that you can observe all the liquid is pouring out fast here but generally in natural process it take time to be separate out so now we just transfer the small amount of a mixture in a test tube now the next step is to add a cold alcohol into it it can be isopropyl alcohol or ethanol now the important viva question why we are adding alcohol here so dna strand are generally soluble in some liquid that it can be easily dissolved in some liquid but it is insoluble in alcohol so alcohol helps the clumps of dna to form so initially when we add alcohol into the solution it form a separate layer here you can observe a small layer of alcohol you can observe over the mixture now after some time all the dna strands will just separate out in this liquid you can observe here some bubbles and cloudy material moving around the alcohol so this is a dna pieces which are clumping together now you can observe that in this alcohol layer some cloudy material is formed so these are the dna pieces which are clumping together now as i have discussed the role of liquid soap that it helps to break the cell membrane and release the dna now what is the role of salt which we have added initially this salt will help the dna strand to stick to each other in a lump that is large enough for us to see now with the help of stirrer we just start poking the cloudy stuff in the alcohol layer and you can observe that this cloudy layer easily separated out when we just spin the stirrer in it and you will able to just collect all the dna here so you can observe i am just spinning the stirrer in the place and the dna start gathering over it so this is a dna here you are looking at dna 